We know that ground stop is expected to be lifted at around 930 this morning. We are seeing delays of about 52 minutes, according to the Chicago Department of Aviation. It has just been an overall exhausting morning for thousands of passengers here at Midway Airport after Southwest canceled dozens of flights last night and into this morning. Many passengers trying to figure out how they can get their bags. Those passengers waiting all night to get them. Now we want to show you some video from a little bit earlier this morning showing you some of those passengers finally getting their bags after waiting for hours. Other passengers left midway early this morning without their suitcases and just rebooked flights at O'Hare just to get out of town regardless of whether or not they had their luggage. This all happened after Southwest blamed the fog and canceled dozens of flights. The airline issuing a statement this morning writing in part quote, we've modified our planned start for today Sunday at Chicago Midway. We have all hands on deck as our employees are working to quickly take care of our customers and accommodate them on alternative flights. So we spoke with one passenger who says she's now driving to Omaha instead of flying to make it a home for Christmas. We got the bag How do you feel? ready to go home. <laughs> it's been over 24 hours since I slept. When you finally saw that bag coming through the conveyor belt, what was I, going through your mind? I literally jumped up and down. Obviously, all this comes after Southwest meltdown around Christmas last year when the airline canceled 17,000 flights, leaving more than 2 million passengers stranded. Just last week, the airline was hit by the federal government with a $140 million fine as a result of last year's travel nightmare. Back here live at Midway, lots of people hoping to make it home for the holidays on time. Back Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.